As somebody who is obsessed with slip-ons, when I found out Jamie Foy's professional shoe had a slip-on version, you already know I had to get a pair and try them out. What's up everybody so this is the jamie foy slip on by new balance and i've been skating these for a while um i've been super busy and that's why this video took a long time to come out but i hope you guys enjoyed the clips i had a lot of fun skating with my friends and getting some some interesting tricks that I haven't done in a while but let's jump into this shoe and talk about what i thought so the first thing i want to go over is this shoe like it looked really good that's probably my favorite part it had just like a really cool casual look to it. And the first thing I noticed is the backs of the shoe right here had this like kind of leather reinforcement layer. And then right here on the ankles, it was nice and thick. Uh, this slip on was like pretty robust. It didn't, I didn't ever feel like my feet were like in danger. Um, the other thing I really liked about this shoe is it just skated like super well. Like all my tricks felt really good. Um, the toe is um, a little bit wider than most slip-ons. It still has a real narrow feel to it, but it wasn't like super wide. I know one of my friends had these shoes and he said they were just like a tad bit too narrow, but he has those like super wide feet. But I think people with like super wide feet kind of run into that problem all the time. For somebody with a narrow foot, um, it actually gave my toes like just a little bit extra room to move around, which felt nice. And then the other thing about this shoe that was pretty cool is like it lasted a really long time like it lasted especially for a slip-on like it lasted so much longer than i think any slip-on i've ever had before but it also lasted longer than like your standard shoe the flick pad right here like i didn't even get all the way through it you know i i ripped a hole right here but if you watch my videos i rip a hole right here on every single shoe because i got this big like lump on my foot so just ignore that but the reason that I think that these last so long is because New Balance, the rubber that they use is like really hard. Now that's good because the shoes last long, but then that ties into the, the thing about the shoe that I didn't really like. So I wore through the bottom of the shoe. I never wear through my, the bottoms of my shoe before the toe cap, like ever. And I think that has something to do with the rubber they use. Like it's super hard and it stands up to like flicking. But when it comes to the bottom where you kind of adjust your foot, I think it actually wears a little quicker. And when you're wearing the shoe, and this is something I've noticed with New Balances because I've had a couple other pairs, the rubber is so hard. And like I said, that's why it lasts long, but it's not the most comfortable shoe. Like it kind of feels like you're standing on like a hard surface. Um, compare this to like Adidas or Nike. It just seems like they use kind of like a softer rubber that's standing up on that sole just feels a lot more comfortable, but they don't last as long. So that's the benefit, but it's kind of like a double-sided sword. So 
The only other complaint I have with this shoe is right here, right above the top of your foot. This little thing's a little bit thin. They can kind of like thicken this up, like maybe put a little bit of a protective layer because I got chopped right here. And then also this side section, really flimsy. Like there's no material right here. There's material all right here. This is pretty reinforced, but there's kind of like this opening right here. And in the video, I did a heel flip crook down this hubba and like I literally bruised my foot. Like this shoe is not the most heel flip friendly. Um, maybe I do my heel flips a little weird. I have a pretty good heel flip. Like I can flip into grinds and all that stuff. Super responsive heel flip. But I did notice when I did a real good wrapped out heel flip, um, kind of like smack the side of my foot right here. And it just felt like I hit like bone on board. Like there was nothing here on the side to kind of like hold my foot back. And I know Jamie Foy does a lot of heel flips. So maybe my heel flips just a little bit different, but those are the things I noticed about this shoe. But overall, great shoe, skated really well, lasted a long time and they look freaking badass. Um, I know these are like the green ones. They had ones that were black and red. And yeah, overall, I highly recommend the shoe. Just wish the sides were a little bit beefed up and maybe that the rubber just felt a little bit softer, but that's something maybe if New Balance sees this video, they can check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you rewatch the clips, I threw in a couple of clips where I actually didn't have these shoes on. I know that's kind of like cheating, but I don't know. I just had so much footage I was sitting on and I wanted to put it all out there before it got old because I know I haven't released a video. So I hope you like this video. Hit that subscribe button and I am going to be dropping a big surprise very soon. So stay tuned. I love you guys and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.